In order to add products to eBay in bulk, you'll want to use our bulk headers guide to understand which fields you need to use for each of the different eBay features. We are going to highlight a few examples here. Just to remind you, of course, you are going to need to add in bulk the same things that you add to an eBay item for listing in the UI. You're still going to need your title, your price, your stock, your condition, your photo, and your eBay category. So let's show you how to do that first in bulk. You'll see when we open the guide that the guide is color coded. The uh, red fields are mandatory. The orange fields are for the general fields that you see when you list an item through the, um, through the actual software. eBay settings, of course, that we're going to be looking for are here in light blue. The spreadsheet has the header column names listed in the first row. The second row has an explanation of how these fields are used. The third row holds a list of valid values for each field. The following fields are required for listing to eBay. The action field, of course, must always be the first column. And you can edit, add, start, and relist or delete, though we do not encourage that. You're going to need a product identifier in the second column. Uh, we always recommend using the GUID. Then you're going to need a stock a price, you're going to need a title, and a condition. Please keep in mind that you want, when adding a condition, to only use the list of valid values described in the third row. Now, of course, you're also going to need to add some photos. To add an image, uh, you can use either the image URL, which is added using the media one header for the first image, media two for the second image, so on and so forth. If you need to know how to add images in bulk, please refer to our bulk training. You can also use the media count if you want to add images straight from your computer. Once again, instructions on how to do this can be found in our training materials. You're also, of course, going to need an eBay category ID, which you can find as you scroll over and find the light blue fields. This is required, and you'll need the ID number, which you can get off of isoldwhat.com. Always make sure that this is a leaf category, which means that it has no subcategories. You'll find the URL that we, we speak of, isoldwhat.com, in the list of valid values. You can also add an eBay store ID. This is for adding your store categories, and you can get the category ID numbers from your channel settings. You can override the eBay price title and description by using the headers that you see here, eBay price, eBay title, eBay description. Then you want to use eBay site ID for choosing which eBay store you're going to use. In this case, if we wanted to list to the eBay US store, we would type the number one. You can choose a duration. Please do make sure when adding a duration that you use the valid values listed below. Now we want to add an eBay listing type. Write fixed price listing, all one word, or Chinese if you're doing an auction listing. Please be aware that Chinese is the word that eBay expects us to send. Uh, it's not a word that we chose for ourselves. If you want to use eBay Best Offer, you want to turn that on by saying true or false. You'll then want to add a price for the eBay Best Offer Minimum Price and eBay Best Offer Auto Accept Price fields. If you're going to use the eBay Buy It Now pricing, then just add a price. To use the eBay Schedule Time in bulk, please make sure that you use the date and time format provided. eBay's Auto Relist feature has several fields which are described in the guide. Please make sure that you refer to the list of valid values on how to fill those out correctly. Keep in mind that any columns that you leave out uh, will be defaulted to whatever you've chosen in your eBay default settings. So you really do only need to add the fields that you need. If you need any help with bulk processing in general, please refer to our training guides. 
Otherwise, that is all you need to know uh, for bulk uploading things to eBay from Shurdan.